excuse my mess, but I was testing a whole bunch of stuff. I got a few things in the mail, so I was a big mess over everywhere. Um, but I wanted to show you uh, Sega Master System games playing on the Red Rod Brew. And uh, right now, this is uh, the adapter I purchased. Got it overseas. It's basically like a um, power base converter, but it fits in here and it doesn't cover over anything or whatever. So it fits. And then on top of here is a Master System game. And also, it's cool because you play it through S Video. And then also, this works on the regular Genesis as well. But this could turn this into the Retron 4 so far. And you could probably turn it, I'm sure, I know you can turn it into a Retron 4, 5, 6, 7, eight. yeah, with a bunch of adapters hanging off of it. <laughs> but anyways, I'm going to uh, switch over to the TV, and I think I'm set to Genesis, and here we go, and here is Rastan playing here and you can actually use your because the Sega Master System has the same plug as the uh, Sega Genesis you can use your Sega Master System controller with your you know games and uh, stuff but it's hard to play with one hand so every game I've actually tried has worked and that's just Rostin. Now, I don't know if it's just when playing through S video, but I get a little black bars, but I actually like the way it looks with the black bars. I don't know why. I think it looks better with the black bars. But uh, yeah, so that's Rostin. I'm playing with one hand, so I can't really. Yeah, kill me. Anyway, so I'm going to show another game. And let's go show another game. Um, Gonna put you here next to all my stacks of video games that I have. If I can't, I need to get it so it doesn't fall down. Uh, yeah, here, look at Shinobi. There's Sega Master System stuff there. Oh, actually, I think I have games under this. I was testing like every game I have. And uh, let's do a light gun game. I have uh, Gangster Town here. Um, so if you use this, you're going to want to take the the adapter out of the... This is the adapter. It has like a old Sega Genesis cartridge uh, on it, and then it has this thing. So you want to take this out first, because if you start plopping the games down on it, you could bend the boards and all that crap. So hold on one second again. Let me take this out. And then I'm going to plop it. Gangster Town, which is a light gun game. Oh, and by the way, this adapter also plays um, a Japanese games as well. And it has a reset button on it, a uh, pause button on it, so that you can pause the games. Because the uh, Master System, for whatever odd reason, had a pause button on the uh, console. So I don't have any Japanese games to try out, but I have... My little uh, stuff here. Oh, God, wires everywhere. <laughs> All right, so... Oh, <laughs> it would help if I hooked up the uh, light gun or the phaser or whatever you want to call it. The Sega Master System phaser. So... so you, all you have to do is plug the phaser into the first port and nothing else. That works well. All right, so... Let me switch over to the Sega Genesis portion, and here we have a light gun game, Gangster Town. Which is a little hard to see with the glare, because, yeah, it's not set up for that stuff. But, yeah, so we'll show you some uh, light gun stuff. Well, first we'll do some Call of Duty. Or, <laughs> okay, anyways. Um, so we'll start this, and... Uh, yeah, hard to see everything. Now that this gun for I mean this game I don't know if it's the game or what is is kind of off so I don't know the calibration seems awkward uh, even on the master system it's not just on this I don't know if it's, I guess it's the gun or something but it works fine with other games I'm not really trying by the way. <sighs> 
No, 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 no. So, yeah. So, you can see that it, it does work. So, yeah. So, we're playing light gun games. So, the only purples that don't work are the ones that use the card uh, slot and can't use card games. Because, yeah, they don't work. <laughs> yep. So, yeah, light gun games work, as you see. So, uh, yeah, that's that. And I will end up... Ooh! Let me shut that off. And I'll show you another game. Let's see, one of my favorites. Where is it? There it is. So, here's one that's not as popular, I guess. But it is one of my favorites, goddammit. And I'll pull this adapter out. Pull out Gangster Town. And I put that down so I don't... The only thing that's a problem with this, where I'll show you, if you haven't already seen it, you see this thing pops out. You know, this this whole board is here, and it you know you got to be very careful with it. So that's kind of a definitely a downside. So, B but I'll show you other stuff working on it. The ninja. Okay, the ninja. Here we go. Pop the game in. And put on thy Sega Genesis portion. And here we go. One thing I forgot to do <laughs> before I uh, do that, I need to plug in a controller, not a light gun. It's not a light gun game. <laughs> there you go. So Genesis, and pick up the actual controller, not the light gun, damn it. All right. So here we go, is the Sega Master System controller. Boom, works with the Sega Genesis controller as well. Now it's gonna be a little hard to do this. So <laughs> play this game, this game is not exactly the easiest to play, yeah. I, it's not gonna work like that, but let's see if I can do it any way I could actually play this. <laughs> play this and show the footage somehow, no? I don't think so. No, not gonna happen. Oh, I actually got someone. Here, let's try to. But, yeah, I guess you get the idea. The, all the games I have work, so, yeah. But, that is the Ninja. So, basically, I'm going to end it there. You, know, you get the idea. It, it works, and it also plays uh, Japanese games. And, uh... Oh, no, game over. Plays them through S-Video, which is really cool. And, uh, not, not if, you have a Se if you're using it on a Sega Genesis. And it kind of costs... Um, just about the same as a, um, what's the phase, a power base converter, but I got it for this because I couldn't find anything else that would work, and it had to be, uh, sent from Hong Kong, because there's only one website that sells it, I'm going to post the link because I honestly don't remember the name of the damn converter I'm using. It is a new third-party converter, so, whatever. But, you know, it's, it's cool, so now it's a Retron 4. <laughs> Anyways, that's that. See ya.